Hi there, Irina, Content Manager at Still Softs here. You probably think that I'm here to create some new TikTok video, but no. I'm here to tell you that we've uh, created a new blog post um, that highlights um, the best practices for creating um, an external documentation site writing Confluence Cloud. And uh, I invite you to read this blog post and to learn some tips and tricks of how to create a separate space in Confluence, um, how to take uh, your page tree into account and um, to create some right page names for your documentations because uh, we know that a lot of teams use Confluence for uh, creating uh, their and maintaining their documentation. And uh, we also um, will show you how to create attractive pages in Confluence uh, to help your users learn more about your products and uh, help them find all the required information about the product roadmap uh, to show them some attractive call to actions with the, with the help of uh, uh, buttons um, and uh, we will show you how to power up uh, Confluence features and um, how to create dynamic status sets and dynamic dates right in Confluence that you can change and update right in the view mode of your page. So I suggest you to take a five minute break from your busy day and read our new blog post. And if you have any questions, feel free to ask us. We are always here to help you. And stay tuned for more updates from Stillsoft. And maybe sometime we will create some TikTok video.